What up, everybody? What's popping with y'all? What the dilly? What the dilly? <laughs> <laughs> what voice is that, my boy? Yeah, what's going on? Uh, it was super deep. It's the it's the right before the water, boy. Somebody drinks some water and turn into CP. <laughs> this is like two blunts, two blunts, a row of crackers, and then no drink. So give me a second. Uh, you was trying to die. Townhouse, my boy. Townhouse original. <laughs> Come on, get up. These right. were no rich. These were them oval bitches. You know what I'm saying? Them motherfucking. Oh, uh, uh, was that townhouse or? Oh, townhouse for sure. Townhouse for sure. Okay. All right, my boy. Oh, townhouse right. for sure. If I'm going to do a cracker, I'm going to do it right. I'm going to do a biscuit. Is it a club cracker? Absolutely club cracker. You know what I'm saying? You know, it just, it just, it's like, you know, like, you know. But it's in the it's in the club family. But these are the townhouse. So you know how the you know the townhouse is like the leasing office of the club. We got to go in there to the townhouse. You know what I'm saying? The Samuel Lee's. You know they got a model. Then you play golf in there. That's where that's at. These crackers is over there. They're not in the club. Okay, that's what's up. I can yeah. see that. Yeah. I can see that. What's up, Lou? How was your weekend? Oh um, man, my weekend was dope. I work. Always a blessing. Oh, Always great. a blessing. I'm tired as hell, though. I'm really oh, yeah, tired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strategically I mean, vague. <laughs> right. Hell of vague. Like, Dope. Work. Right. Yeah. Work. I mean, I don't really do much <laughs> else, that. Pat. I don't do much else. I mean, I play video games. That's it. I don't really you play? do exciting things. Like, I'd be exhausted. You like, ain't playing you... lingerie this weekend. I tapped in. I ain't seen no lingerie, so somebody lying. Hmm? That's exclusive. You got to have, like, a VIP pass at my house. For that. that oh, see, you ain't say that last week. Last week, you was like, I'll be playing video games and lingerie. That's Kanisha Bus. Do not listen to things Kanisha Bus. Here, and you immediately went out and developed a Twitch account and put, put a fake Twitch. You you made a Twitch just. To... <laughs> I was supporting my friends, nigga. With the Twitch. <laughs> Oh man! Let me go ahead and unsubscribe and shit. This nigga eating fruit snacks. Like, why weren't you naked the other day? <laughs> <laughs> I joined your little live. <laughs> a little live. I joined your little live. <laughs> it was a call. It was all duty, no booty. What the fuck? Is going on? <laughs> yeah, that's for VIPs only. That's VIP status. Hey, Lulu, they don't know what kind of adventures we be going on in our personal time in the gaming world. Don't say you didn't do nothing. You could have you could have defeated a whole SEAL Team 6 or, or explored the, the forests and collected mushrooms. You don't know what we'd be doing. I'm going to tell you all right now. There's a game on PS5. Did, it's, called, it's called Pizza Run. Bro, me and my daughters have been playing this shit all weekend. Like, tears were shed over this game this game is serious and it's nothing but a side scroll mobile style game of this pizza that's jumping from platform to platform but bro this shit is like if you do not time oh, you are jumps, the pizza yeah if, if you don't time them jumps right and you gotta what are you jumping stick, over toppings uh you jump over like so you know how those little signs be outside a restaurant that tell you the specials they be like this the little signs mm -hmm. like a little, you gotta jump over those you gotta collect pizzas and uh, sometimes there's one slice out of you missing, which gives you like a little Pac-Man style face. Oh, you a full like, pizza. I was I was thinking of a slice. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, no, no. But then this, the slice has gone rogue. So the slice is evil. So the slice is like shooting at you, you know, and, and it's I'm your in. own slice. It'd be your own slice. It'd be your own slices. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's but, like uh, Temple, Temple Road run, but pizza yeah. run. Got it. Game was The game was $2.99, and uh, we had a damn good time this weekend playing... Uh, pizza run all right yeah and uh so i'm going on the road uh june 3rd and uh you know i'm bringing my openers and shit but i'm bringing pizza run you better have some good ass fucking child hell yeah about to put some uh, money, um, on the money on the floor pizza run lulu i would wanted to ask the same question but i feel like if i had said what y'all jumping over top is able to make shut your fat ass up you always thinking about food <laughs> Bro, I saw cp it didn't stop talking i was gonna say something to lulu listen like i saw it play out in my head i docked the strange the shit out of it and i was like nope i ain't doing I mean, that. why would it jump over toppings what else would pizza be jumping over I would but here the thing though people 
to hear. But the way you okay. said it just now, even in your example, made me want to tell you to shut your fat ass up because, <laughs> because you almost seem disgusted that it would jump over the top instead of enjoying them. <laughs> That's what I was Why would it jump over him? It's like, why wouldn't you want to be dressed, my nigga? Go get dressed. Uh, <laughs> all pizzas is dressed. different. All pizzas is like, ew, get that pineapple off of me. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could jump over pineapple. You could jump over hungry people. You could jump over turtles. You could jump over tahirs. Pigeons? You could jump over a you whole jump bunch over of pigeons stuff. And stuff. Hey, man, fuck here is, you, Pat. Tahir is the final boss. <laughs> no one's ever beat him. And he, no he don't got no ever shirt. It's just yeah. the pants and pizza slices and sauce on his chest. He and has a like, little ah. attack. He's attacking like freckle frenzy, freckle frenzy. <laughs> like, Zero go. have passed. <laughs> <laughs> How did me say no pizza shall say, pass? I didn't ask a question because I didn't want to get roasted. Turn it to me getting roasted. <laughs> you niggas, you niggas is different, bro. Freckle frenzy, freckle frenzy. <laughs> he got a cloak of pepperoni. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Ty over there is like the auntie that's watching the kids. She's like, long as they ain't fighting, they all right. <laughs> <laughs> Don't anybody bleeding? Am I right? Ain't nobody <laughs> bleeding. They are. <laughs> Go ahead, let him play. Let him I thought she was going to light up a cigarette in a minute. Oh, she going to do that. <laughs> she was like, go ahead, go ahead. Oh, I'm going to do that um, anyway. That's because that's how I am. <laughs> well, I'm going to do that anyway. I'm grown. I'm grown. You don't need to be worried about it. But I'm going to play with your little cousins then. Don't worry about what Miss Ty doing. Don't worry about what I'm doing. Ty looked like she about to say, make it enough. Hey, Ty say that's a nigga. Yes, I did. Ty say that's a nigga. She fucked. She be like, going. Yes, I did. She like she about to say, I ain't one of your little friends. I am not Boo Boo the fool. Okay, hold on. I'm not Boo Boo the fool. You walk home from school and Ty is sitting on the porch like that. Your teacher called me today. Like, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Why the fuck do my phone got to ring every goddamn week and it's your teacher? Look, but she wasn't doing nothing. Interrupting my goddamn stories. I had to turn to be. <laughs> I like what you did there to hear. I like how you deflected. Shifted the, that motherfucker heat off that all <laughs> And put it on me. I, I, Damn I, I, I was doing the laundry, fucked up the laundry. I burnt the socks. <laughs> can you do that you know you gotta wash that dryer you, you can't let that dryer go I'm on the phone with this bitch I talking about you I didn't, I didn't burn y'all, the has, have y'all ever experienced a dryer that got too hot anybody family yep. you had one that you grew up with I didn't get hot enough them hood dryers get way too hot yeah nigga on the, uh, when I was living in St. Louis before I got my washer and dryer nigga I used to go to this laundromat like you damn near had to have like a, a hazmat suit on to take the, the, the jeans and shit off because the buttons would get so fucking hot you would literally burn the shit out of yourself wow. on one of the buttons or one of the little rivets on the yeah. pants or anything like wow. that. That shit was really got in there. That sounded like a time machine. <laughs> Right, <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> nigga stumble out. What year is it? <laughs> what year is that? <laughs> my fuck around, go to the skinny realm. Like I'm so skinny here. <laughs> hey, fuck you, CP. I have you know I'm down ten I'm pounds. I'm so thin in this realm. <laughs> ten Good pounds you, down, nigga. You. I'm not stopping till we at thirty. If you was how many down? Fighter, ten. Oh, I'm down fourteen. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I'm exactly well, I'm the way I was. Five, so <laughs> you up five. I'm exactly the way that I was. I have let me tell you, that. let me tell you, Todd. None of us was gonna ask because we want to get in trouble, get sent to bed at two o'clock p.m. Nigga, so none of us. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody was asking him going to jail for that, nigga. Yeah, that's five. Ain't nothing but alcohol and some sugars and some chips and some candies and shit. Something in me just wants to run to the store for Todd. <laughs> But but you better bring back a motherfucking change. <laughs> I'm about to run to the oh stove. And I want the receipt. Cause I don't Ooh. Oh, oh like, you a petty motherfucker petty. to make somebody oh, receipt. Damn, receipt. I just want the receipt. All right, From cool. the hood store. And change. You know the hood store gonna give you that skinny ass receipt. Ain't shit on there, but the numbers. You don't need yeah, it'll tell you what you bought, how much you bought. It was Nothing. Just, just the price. This is it. It's your fault receipt. I'm stealing. 
<laughs> you want the receipt? I could have swindled everything, but now I have to steal because apparently you want to you want to audit my store trip. So <laughs> y'all so funny. I like what's that. the what's the last thing y'all stole that was petty? Mm, oh, I stole this Homer Simpson um keychain from uh uh, Universal Studios because I, I bought like my daughters had rallied up all this shit in there and then the guy was like oh was this yours and I was like yeah that's mine and he put it in a bag my daughter was like that wasn't yours that's not stealing though no it, it, that's it like, was uh, that's accepting he, he finessed it he finessed it it was a finesse yeah but my daughter she kind of looked at me the rest of the night like wow you think you know a person <laughs> <laughs> you think you know somebody in there they still in homers <laughs> no i ain't really still That's like funny. that i don't know you ain't never stole nothing petty i think i have like maybe some gum or something i don't know when we was in Houston, Pat and uh, Ty was with me. I stole two two uh, two cigarettes out of her purse every day, just on GP. <laughs> Where's so my damn you. cigarettes? I stole some uh, Werther's originals from Ty. <laughs> wow. Okay. Oh, yeah, still for okay, people. Cool. No, I I, right. I took uh, I took all her butterscotch candies and her uh, little strawberry wrapped candies. Ty guess, was it with her handkerchief? <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was in a plastic bag next to the, the white diamonds perfume she had in the purse. Wow, this is what we're doing. Okay, white okay. diamond. I also took a little milk and magnesium. My bad. It's all fun and game. I'm gonna see you. I'm gonna see you this weekend to here and like while you just sitting there randomly just doing nothing. I'm just gonna reach into my purse, grab some tissue, and grab your nose, and make you blow your nose in front of people. Keep it up. Damn, Ty yeah, gonna come Ty, up. Ty, Ty, go, Ty go clean your ears out. <laughs> she gonna go like this. I went to Ty's purse. She had a Pez dispenser full of Tums. I was like, what are you eating? <laughs> you know like, I just yours. popped two. I'm about you to feel You know that was yours to hear. You ate <laughs> all oh, the I got keep the Tums on deck, baby. What I know you put, you took all the Pez out and put the Tums in. I know what you be doing. Look, mm -hmm. I keep mm -hmm. the Tums on deck. Hey, that was really? in uh, that was in arm's reach. Listen, I'll be eating up here when we do lunchtime lottery. If I have something too acidic, I'll let me pop two of these motherfuckers before my store and start yelling at me. I ain't taking no chances. Tums backwards is smut. <laughs> <laughs> you are not welcome in their marketing room. Listen, I'm tell you that right now. I don't know why I was funny. I don't know he why just he floated said it out there. But <laughs> the timing was impeccable. I just figured. I love out. the way your mind works, CP. It's just uh -huh. crazy. Uh -huh. Just like a serial killer. Let's jump right into the first topic. Uh, it's funny because you're a serial killer. Ain't <laughs> 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 <Hey>, no <laughs> first flakes. I'm taking Don't all the box. <laughs> he takes the serial <laughs> tops as trophies. What's up, ladies? <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> I'll be hey, all on getting that car to hear me in the back seat like. Thought you got away, didn't you, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> he probably has some yeah. cold ass one liners like, guess it was for kids. <laughs> <laughs> I'm magically <laughs> delicious. <laughs> here comes Syria walking home from school. <laughs> that kill was great. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> I want to give a shout out to Ty Davis for jumping in with us today. Shout out to Lulu Gonzalez, and we got the original squad here, me. Uh, CP, Pat Cloud, shout out to Dang. May School. She'll be back in a couple of weeks. Uh, we're going to go on and jump into this first topic right after this. First topic of the day we have, would you rather have a bad figure and be great at sex versus have a great figure and be bad at sex? Easy. Wait, wait, what's a what's wait. a bad figure? What, what? Like, you like know, not... obese, you know, a little bit. But where obese. does that start? No, Pat, um, don't give him anything. We're yeah, all set. Listen, I'm bad bodied enough. I'm good at what I do. I think I'm already set where I'm going. Pat, because see, Pat, you give him that then to, then to hear is like, well, you got diabetes version two. And, <laughs> you know, 
Big mama, your arm. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You got her. Like, and are we like 300 pounds? No. Oh, my God. No, just bad body. Just, just, just not, bad body. Not ideal. Whatever, whatever not ideal. Bad T-shirt body in the listen. pool. Whatever we're, that we're, is. Nah, that's above bad body, though. <laughs> we're not, we're not here to put labels on bodies because whatever you might be a person that has two pounds of weight and you consider yourself unhealthy because that's how right. you look at yourself. So whatever your perspective is of a bad body is what it is. Give me the bad body. Cause here's the thing. Good bodies are supposed to be sexually attractive. You know what I mean? It's not like you just want to be at a pool party and be just looked at, you know what I mean? Like at the end of the day, that eventually leads to the smashing. So if you, catfish a nigga uh or 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 you know you catfish everybody around you and you got trash penis or vagina then that's just that's just gonna end bad for everybody as opposed to you know you you a little bad built but you can still convince somebody you got some jokes or something and then you blow them away you know what i'm saying that's that's you could always get in the gym and jog a little bit i'm gonna tell you and when the word gets out about Mm. what you're doing well, get, well, well, you know, guess what? You know what I'm saying? Hey, like all state, you're in good, bad bodied hands. At that point, you know what I'm saying? You know, and there's they, no pressure. I'm gonna tell you what, also, too, girls like smashing a bad body nigga because girls are greedy by nature. So if 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 everything is good, then this nigga be like, you trying to order a pizza real quick? They be like, she be like, no. fuck yeah. Oh, that's oh, that's what so. the I don't I don't think so. Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm, oh yeah. I'm not gonna go with that it's one. Just, it's not your flavor. What is That's what far? women told CP though, and he was like, "Yeah." Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bet, 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 bet. Smoke I don't know. About, I don't know about y'all. I don't know about Ty. I can't speak for all the women, but I ain't never been like, "Ooh, look at that bad built nigga." Let me go spend time with him. <laughs> I don't, that ain't never worked. Grocery shopping with this big ass nigga, real quick. No. Only time I've ended up with a bad built nigga is by accident, you know. And you know it was cool, but I always looked at him like, "Ooh, I could, I could change this and make this into something." Why are you always looking for a project? No, I don't want no project. That's the thing. I don't want no project. I, I, I like. That's why I go to the gym and <laughs> highlight the niggas that's in shape. Uh, so, <laughs> but I've had in shape men with bad penis. But you know, and that's a whole other thing. Hey, to, to him, he like, long as he get his nut, he ain't tripping. That nigga can have horrible sex, but he gonna get his. You just ain't gonna smash again, but he gonna be out there tricking another chick because he got a good body. Yeah, he's still gonna keep smashing. To me a times. But here's here's the thing: if you have trash sex, that getting out because people, if you have a nice body, everybody knows. But if you talk to somebody like if you talk to somebody who smashed like the baddest chick that you've ever seen, or if a uh, if a if a chick talks to a uh, a chick that smashed like her ideal dude, if if they tell them like oh, the pussy was trash or the dick was trash. They low-key lose points. You're kind of yeah. like not as interested in them mm-hmm. in, a, in, a, in a certain way, even, though, you, even though it could have been them, you know, that, that caused that performance. But you, you, still, like, you still want to see for yourself. It's like a, when you, you see ratings for movies all the time. Sometimes like Rotten Tomatoes might give that shit a bad rating, but you still be like, ah, I still want to Right, that. but, but compared to someone who's okay, okay, like an okay girl or okay dude who, who they're, they're, whoever they smashing is telling everybody like, Yo, that's the ship. That person will always get more attention and more fun than the opposite. Like having ha- being good at sex is like being a popular uh, roller coaster ride at, a, at an attraction. Everybody's like, you got to ride that Viper, got to ride that Viper. And then this w- word gets out and you just like the popular. Well, damn, I don't call myself a popular roller coaster. <laughs> <Don't ride me. laughs> you just, just the fucking popular. You the Six Flags nigga. I got a theory that like super fine people ain't good at sex. I just feel like God couldn't make it that empty. I, <laughs> I feel like you gotta you gotta suck as you can't wake up and just be fine as fuck, just chiseled and all of I this. I ain't never had a bad you not seen a porn star, my nigga. Some of the best <laughs> doing it are some of the best looking motherfuckers. <laughs> like, a lot of that shit lot is of fake. Very cute. I know a lot of very cute and handsome men who have great bodies and great penis. Let me like, tell you something. Let me tell you something. The, the fact grail. that you said handsome men means that they not fine by other people's standards then. No, they are. They they super fine. They super fine. Okay. Super fine. Ooh, handsome okay. means everybody can't pull off handsome. Handsome is a whole different girl. thing. I'll, sh- I'll say you pictures. I'll say you some pictures. <laughs> but I also know some real <laughs> fine men that ain't got some shit that's some trash. Now, I let them know 
that is trash and you got a great body, but I can't do, you, do this no more. Do you let a person know if they trash? Like I've told people like that they were they were starfish, they were lazy and shit like that. But if it was trash, trash, would you let that person know that they were trash? Nicely, yes. It depends if they was if they talking shit. Like I remember one time I had smashed this little young thing and he this was when Instagram was like still kind of new, like 2012. And he left my house because I put him out because he was awful at everything. This wait, 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 wait. Describe that part. How'd you put him out? <laughs> young man, young man. Get your get your clothes. I, I called you I said, once. You'll be here in a couple I, of minutes. I said, I said what you about to do? And never come back. I said, what you about to do? And he was like, oh, I thought we was going to kick it. And I was like, no, nah, I got to work in the morning. So, you But know. you didn't tell him then. You're a you comedian. Tell him, so, you're a comedian. If you let me you finish, like, Wait a minute. Ain't no comedy clubs in the morning. <laughs> patriarchy, over-talking me. So he left. And I was on Instagram. And I saw that he posted a meme. And it was like, I tore the pussy up. And I went right in them comments. I was like, you ain't tear up shit. Stop lying. Cause I ain't like that. Don't go on Instagram. Like you already had that meme in the clip. Come on, bro. What you doing? <laughs> yeah. I had to tell one. As you can just damage. be quiet and not say nothing, but you want to go out here on Instagram and lie. Oh no. My God. Yeah. Now I had a young dude had, had to do the same. There's always these young dudes that they, they be thinking they doing something. And he was like, he wanted to cuddle and all of this shit. And I was like, nah, man, you ain't here for that. I was like, you could come back when you fuck me the way you're supposed to be fucking me. And you can leave. And he was like, but I took the bus. I was like, the bus is right there. You can go take Still it. Run it. Hey, I didn't, man, Lulu for show moves like a nigga. I, I oh, yeah. always, I always heard it, but I never, until I saw how you, how you handled the dude in person, I was just like, oh shit, Lulu. Lulu is a nigga. <laughs> Fair too. I've had like some less than stellar rounds with Farron and she would tap me on my shoulder and be like, hey, get you about 10, 15, because that was some bullshit. I'll be back in a minute. Mm -hmm. And I that, mean, that's fair. That's a nice one. That's a nice yeah, way of doing before. it. Like, for the most part, I won't say nothing. I'll just never call them again or never yeah. answer the phone or see Same. them in public and act like I don't know them. You know, I'm mm. nice about it. Same, I mean, but then they get the hint from that. I've grown up around a lot of male environments. I played basketball. I, you know, I was in the military and, and you know, I've, I've been around a lot of men who school me, unfortunately, to the bullshit. So I just took all of that in and sometimes it just comes out in their <clears throat> vernacular and how they would. Now, now, is this, is this bad? The, the people that y'all been with, is it bad in the sense of like, is this horrible? Or is it bad in the sense of like, it could be coached, but you don't feel like putting in the time. Cause that's different too. I, we oh, we too old for that. Here's sometimes, the thing. For look, me, hey, I've been I've been out here for a while. I've, I've, I've been out here for a while. She has a real traveled vagina, is what she's saying. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I don't well I don't know my body count. I think it's stupid for me to even try to figure out what that number is. I just it's I don't know it. And this guy that I just told y'all about was the absolute worst I've ever had. And most women only know their best, their worst, their first, their last, you know, and if they got kids, the father and them kids. If you've been with 20 dudes, you don't remember all 20. You just remember the best of the 20, the worst of the 20, father of your kids, and maybe somebody was that. This nigga was the worst <clears throat> nigga I ever had. He was Why? bad at everything. Kissing, cuddling, touching, Kissing? eating coochie, finger Man, everything, the bad thing? at it. What's his name? Like I, I had to stop name. him from each, 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 each round of what we were doing. I was like, let's, let's, let's try something else. And it was so Damn. bad that I couldn't believe that he thought it was good on my end. I was like, sir, how did you think this was good? I was equally as awful as you were. Like I could had no rhythm. It was like, man, what you about to do? Cause I got a little work. Hey, I was saying, you know, I was mad that I put them little miles on my cat. Did you, you finish? Did you finish? finish? We couldn't get started, Pat. What you mean, finish? Uh, I mean, I finished myself. She's so still left. upset about I it. Ate. That shit is crazy. She said, finish? <laughs> <laughs> Patrick, are you serious? First of all, look. <laughs> finish? <laughs> <laughs> 
He's oh, stupid God. as hell. <laughs> <laughs> what am I finished with? What am I finished with? Sorry, my nigga. We didn't even get Hold started. <laughs> finish! <laughs> hey, Ty kicked that nigga out them leopard sheets so fast. <laughs> 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 Oh, Boy, get your ass out of here. Uh, oh my <laughs> Where my shoes at? Under that picture of them two Panthers in my living room. <laughs> <laughs> she stood at the back of the door to make sure he didn't wash up with her decorative towels. No, 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 not that towel. Oh, How old do y'all think I am? <laughs> funny, bro. Two, a two Panther picture is just, you know if there's a two Panther picture somewhere in there. <laughs> A felt, a felt. Uh, like y'all, y'all really think I'm old? Like <laughs> she poured her crazy. a glass of two X moonshine and said, "This is some bullshit." You know, you know, you know, you know. When I first got my two panther picture, you know, I said, "This whole living room finna change for the better." Y'all <laughs> was standing at the door when it got there. Come on in, young man. I poured us some MD twenty twenty. Crack over the wrist. I got that for Renaissance. I ended up paying it off. I ended up paying it off. <laughs> two Panther picture. Look up, look, look up. Go in there after two Panther. It's the only one you're going to get in Baltimore. It's two Panther picture. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, hold on. I'm going to say this shit. though. I'm going to say this though. I'm going to say this though. Sometimes the chemistry between two people is terrible. Mm -hmm. mm. Right? So because of that, you have to acknowledge when the chemistry is on point. Yeah, right yeah. when the chemistry is amazing you're like oh my god i got a great sexual chemistry with this person you have to also acknowledge that there is people out there who you have completely zero sexual compatibility with mm -hmm. and the only thing y'all have in common only thing y'all have in common is the will to fuck each other like well you, yeah. you want to fuck sure let's try this and it's like you know what i'm saying like you know y'all just yinging and yanging and i feel like you know, you ever you ever heard somebody was really dope, and then when you get a chance to do your thing, and it's not really dope with them, and it's like, it's nah, just, I don't, it's, I don't, I don't. It could be the opposite though. They could say like yeah. it was trash with them, and when, right, and, and then to be dope, dope, be dope, right? And you be like, wait a minute, yeah. am I trash or is this? You know what I'm saying? You know, but it's just one of those things where it's like, people just, it's a lot of different people doing a lot of different things. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, Let's put it to a vote. Let's put it to a vote. Oh, it's already been voted. Bad body. Bad figure, good bad body. sex. What is it? What y'all going with? Bad body. Bad body, bad good, body sex. good sex. Yep. No, I uh, I want the good body with the bad sex. I'm sorry. What you going to do with that? Looks like we're not Look done. good. Explain yourself. But he can't fuck because, you. Listen, y'all y'all can't just say all of this stuff about me being old. Think I'm still out here trying to trying to do whole stuff and sex and stuff. But my, I'm, my time is up. I'm out of my prime, man. I just want to look good now. I ain't trying to get these old ass meat curtains to nobody, son. This, this I know what's going on down here. I call you old, Ty. You're just on the porch with a robe and a cigarette. That, that, I'm out the game, baby. I'm retired. This is what retirement looks That's like. I old ass meat look. curtain. Good. <laughs> hey, man, this hey, man. This coochie was manufactured in the late 70s, bro. They, they, man, we, the jig is up. It's over for me. I just want to look good, like them Instagram girls, just with the two piece bikini on, and their stomach is flat, them don't and get they all greased up. I know them. They don't get fucked. <laughs> and when they do, you don't, don't see you don't see all the stuff behind the scenes when they, they do. They not fucking. I don't you want to fuck. no more. I want to look good naked. You know what I'm saying? Like whenever I'm looking at myself in the mirror naked, that's when I gotta really do my affirmations. Like you is kind. You is smart. You, I, no, man, I want to look at my teeth and be like, You can yeah. have a bad Hold body up. if you look in the mirror and be like, I'm going to drink water today. You're not I'm gonna understanding. Eat today. Nah, I'm going to do this I don't today. Do You're going to have a bad body regardless. Lulu, Lulu she is ready to retire her coochie yeah. into a I'm bread and hoagie. Into like I'm a hoagie bread. Just put it, slide it down into a hoagie bread. It is retired the roast beef <laughs> into a sandwich. And she had the end of hanging line. She had the end like, what you want this with this? this? You want chips? You Just want a Baltimore this. cheese steak with <laughs> you know, That's it. I'm done. I'm in my final season. Fries. You want three I'm cookies finished. with this I just to go? Want, I want the great body with the bad sex. And since my body gonna look so good, my sex gonna be so bad, I'm not even gonna be having sex. So it's not like I'm gonna be ruining the sex pool because I'm not in the pool. Yeah, I don't think y'all gonna be fucking around. when you old. 
I'm be, I got a good 30 something years done. left of fucking in me. I'm I want to be an good. old dude who still fucks. Mm-hmm. My dad asked me, see, my dad asked me the other day, he's like, hey, can you uh give me some pills? You know, uh, I was like, what the hell are you asking me? He's like, hey, man, I still need to get it up. You know, your mother here, you know, uh, I was like, talk to your son. Dude, I'm not giving you no pills. I'm not it's doing this. Like, you see, on, you man, be doing them Bluetooth ass. You're like, well, well yeah, I'm going to call Lulu. Shit. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, hey, listen. Here, can you tell my DC. daddy some pills? I got them. I got, I got a couple to spare. Looks like the bad body, good sex, take it. Uh, We're going to jump right into this next topic right after this. You got to pick one for life. You only eat one for the rest of your life. Barbecue versus pizza. That means you can't have barbecue chicken pizza. No, you can, right? Because it's pizza. Aha. Uh-huh. But it's uh-huh. bar- it has barbecue on it. Yeah. yeah but, nah, it's not, nah, but it's not nah, like top tier barbecue. Can't do that. Can't do that. It's like, can't do it. it's like can't do that. why can't you? To hear that's that's a popular pizza. It's not like we're making oh, it. Oh, yeah, CPK. Barbecue. Ain't no other place yeah. that made barbecue chicken pizza popular. Jeez. outside of CPK. regular. Everybody makes Domino's got a fire ass barbecue chicken pizza. When I say you fire, ain't ordering ass, that shit I don't on really regular CP. You ain't ordering on the regular. Why are you getting upset with me that it exists? <laughs> I ain't mad that it exists. I've had it before. <laughs> they, use the the they use the barbecue sauce as the sauce. They don't use the red, the, the uh, tomato sauce on that, but I've had it before. Nigga. It is a pizza. They got breakfast pizzas. They got fruit pizzas. I got to go with pizza because of the shit that they can do with pizza. Yeah. The fact that you call it barbecue. a pizza is the pizza. Mm-hmm. I, I, I hear what you're saying. I'm going to go with pizza. You got a lot of different cuts of meat I'm with barbecue, barbecue, though. Yeah, what? they all I mean, How many different here. cuts of barbecue? You got you got uh, ribeye. Chicken. You got the I'll chicken. Pork. You got beef or pork ribs. You got uh, uh, you got the uh, roast. Brisket? You got you could you could barbecue brisket? seafood. You could barbecue salmon. You could barbecue mm. lobster tail. And put it all on a pizza. Mm-hmm. <laughs> lobster pizza from berries is fire. Hey, but does that include sides? Because you said oh, only that. Question. Yeah, ain't no size. It's either it's either barbecue, whatever it is. Or yeah, I can't just be oh. eating meat for the rest of my <laughs> yeah. life. You can no, literally do... sit anything on a pizza, and it's a pizza. You could sit right. a telephone on a pizza, and it's still a pizza. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, pizza. Core. What is the Ooh. definition of pizza? Because you, if you. You could sw- technically switch up the ingredients because Domino's, you can get Alfredo instead of uh, tomato or yeah, you get barbecue. A white sauce. You get a white sauce on the pizza. So is the pizza just the layers itself or is it really the cheese? That it's makes the it bread, up? sauce, cheese, toppings. So, I mean, okay. oh, it's not the cheese. It's not the cheese. Not How's the not cheese. the cheese? Because you can get a pizza with no cheese, my nigga, and it's still a pizza. Yeah, it is, but don't nobody. I mean, the people that order pizza People are no lactose cheese, intolerant. It ain't and the very intolerant people. A I pizza, a pizza is a flat. No- a pizza is a flat open pie. My a nigga, flat- you, know, you gonna go to a pizza party, and they got all the pizzas that ain't got no cheese there. You gonna have something to say about? But all the what there to here? All the pizzas that they exactly. told you They're were pizzas. going to be there have no They're cheese pizzas. on. Them. They are pizzas. Nah, fuck that. So people with no legs aren't <laughs> people. That's not what we saying. People, hey, people, yo. people, That's people with no legs saying. are people. Hey, are people make me with no, okay, I got a question. Are You're people not make me intolerant? No, fuck you. Sissy. Listen, are people with no legs pedestrians? What? Can people with no leg? Never mind. Y- y'all gonna give me. I'm not doing this with y'all. I'm, I'm not, not. I'm not gonna get counsel for you niggas. Yeah, I'm I'm not, that it. was a question. So you technically, nah. cheese is part of the definition, or the ones that I've seen. No. No. So I mean, not the definition of a pizza. No, they I mean, look up the definition. The definition people. There, no, there are, I feel like there are pizzas without cheese, but does that change it? You know what I mean? It's kind of like a if taco. A, but if like, it's a pizza without cheese, then, nigga, then theoretically it's, toast. it's already a pizza. If it's a pizza with no cheese, it's toast, nigga. You have a sauced up piece of toast with pepperoni on it. I mean, Blaze makes a pizza with no cheese and they still call it a pizza. That's toast. Okay, so actually the uh, Webster definition is a dish typically f- of flattened bread dough spread with a uh, savory mixture, usually including tomatoes and cheese. So there, are, it, there was a usually in the actual definition. And it said typically of bread dough. So I guess technically you could change that too. 
typically the, yeah is a big word and a definition which means all of them are pieces which means i'm putting barbecue brisket i'm putting barbecue chicken i'm putting barbecue crab legs but but but, but, but CP, if, if, this, if this wizard forbids you from eating barbecue then technically you could have everything besides toppings so i guess both of y'all are kind of right like if you physically couldn't eat barbecue then that would include putting a barbecued chicken on oh, a pizza. pizza. But we get all the other toppings. I'm going pizza. I can't oh, just be eating pizza. straight up barbecue. Yeah, I'm going pizza. Yeah, Because I only like barbecue in the summertime anyway. I ain't never been in the winter like, ooh, I want some ribs and some brisket. Really? They never ate me. no rib brisket in the cold? What's wrong we were you? doing, but we switched to barbecue for like, for for like Christmas for like three Christmases. We just got tired of the, the traditional shit and just switched it up and did and did barbecue for like three Christmas. That's I fun. like barbecue. Kansas City got some real good barbecue. Man. Yeah, they got vinegar base. Yeah, they got a vinegar Ooh. base sauce. I hear they're Ooh. better than like Memphis and uh St. Louis when it comes it's to barbecue. It's, it's really I've never had taste, their barbecue. Yeah, it's really it's, I, 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 yeah. it's really on your taste. Because the, the base is different in every place. You got a mustard mm. base. You got a vinegar base. You got like a uh, the the sweeter ones with the honey brown base and all base. that the brown yeah. sugar base. So it really just depends. And, and often the time your region dictates your taste. So Texas mm. is big on the rubs, which I I really enjoy a good savory rub. Um, Memphis is Memphis is a lot of smoke, mm -hmm. a lot of smoke in Memphis. Um, that vinegar base in the in the Kansas City, Kansas City. St. Louis area. Yeah, okay. that's let me ask y'all a question. If 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 there's no barbecue sauce on the meat, it's just a rub. Is that a barbecue or a cookout? Because I've always called that a cookout when y'all ain't got a barbecue sauce. Say that again. Like I've been to barbecues that didn't have barbecue sauce. And I'm like, nigga, this ain't a barbecue, then it's it's a it's a cookout. But I thought Barbe the barbecue was more about the grill, not the sauce. I can't yeah. believe you're asking these questions to hear. It's like, I want to get you a dictionary or like a small assistant that could be like, to hear, don't say that. You know what I'm saying? Like, to hear, don't ask I, that. The sauce was made it's specifically- A cookout this is meal. just the event. <laughs> nah, man, they ain't got no barbecue sauce. White people have cookouts, black people have barbecue. What about the barbecue grill? They don't make because you could just cook a burger on there and throw some cheese and some ketchup on there. That ain't nothing but a barbecue. That's flame broiled. But you barbecued that burger. You cook that bar that burger on the open flame the same way that burger on a barbecue does, grill. It don't matter the grill, nigga. If Here. it's on the open flame, it's only barbecue with the sauce. You have glasses on. I can't believe you're saying this. How are you not getting with this? I, I thought you, a master cure, would agree with this. It's not barbecue if you don't have the sauce. No, that's not true, bro. Barbecue is just the, put it like this. There you go, some lying shit. No, barbecue sauce, right? It's the sauce of the barbecue, which means that you add this to the barbecue. This is for the barbecue. That's like that's saying, what makes a barbecue. Dog. Listen, listen, listen. The way that the adjective lines up, hot dog bun. This is the bun. You can have a hot dog without the bun, but this is the hot dog bun. That's the barbecue sauce. You put that sauce on the barbecue. Anything on the grill is being barbecued, but it just grilled, cued, all of that is the same thing. A let me, let me, let me tell you something. Listen, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Eggs are fried on the griddle. Here, hold on, grill. here, hold on. So here, a cookout is when more than your immediate family that live in your house is invited to that place to enjoy what you, what you barbecue. Who barbecuing at the cookout is what they say. And they say it's who the on same grill word. At the barbecue. That's what they say. So okay, they say so who's the, barbecuing at the barbecue. The definition see, of see, barbecue. Let me say this. You you made a lot of sense, but it's damaging to my argument. So fuck you. What you say, Pat? The definition of barbecue is just to roast or broil uh, food <laughs> such as meat on a rack or revolving spit before a source of heat like hot coals or a gas flame. So it's really just the like the preparation of cooking uh, over low heat and smoke. So literally, even cavemen that are just having like that little rotating thing over the fry, they're technically barbecuing. So it really is more about the. Oh, they was definitely barbecuing. They was, they was out there talking shit. So they were, <laughs> but just <laughs> with grunts. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I tasted this. Ooh, mm, mm, mm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. But you knew what they meant too. Every grunt had a different. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> All right, my, my bad. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I just wanted to say that. I'm, so it seems I'm, like I'm looking. For, I'm looking for other definitions that support my argument. Why? Why? <laughs> why? Why are you doing that? I think cookout and barbecue are the same thing, but just one from culturally different uh, standpoints. Yeah, I've like, never heard that before about the whole barbecue. That's because y'all been lost your whole lives. I'm trying to bring you to lost. light. Y'all fighting it. To hear ever since you put on those goddamn minion glasses. Everything you said today is <laughs> oh, so oh, I can't no. unsee it now. <laughs> He's like the dude that dated the millions, mom. <laughs> you know, you know, you know, all the, all the, I got my 400 uh, stepsons, man. They all cool. <laughs> but, but, <laughs> hey, you have any overalls? <laughs> Do the last question in overalls. <laughs> Go put on a yellow t-shirt. You got a yellow t-shirt? Uh, no, just take your shirt off and you'll be the minion. Put the overalls on, take your shirt off. Everybody having a good time? You over there laughing too, Ty? You having a good time over there? I didn't say anything. Uh -huh. Ty, you can go ahead and laugh. It's okay. Ty, you grin, you in. I saw you over there trying to hold it in. You grin, you in. I didn't say anything. Hey, to hear like the first Irish minion. Yeah, you know, they put me out because I, I, I got a little bit of black in me. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? They was calling me an onion. Ty, don't try to press your lips together and don't laugh. They was calling me an onion, man, because I'm a little bigger than the rest of them. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you do it, Ty. Don't you do it. Swallow that fucking giggle, Ty. Uh, he's, 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 uh, he's, uh, overalls, the overalls in the back, they got the buttons that come out. You see his butt, like yeah. little kids. They got the little buttons in the back. These Hold are all my together, minions. Ty. I have one onion, and uh, come this way. <laughs> <laughs> Hold it together, Ty. Don't do it. Don't let them ruin our friendship. She gonna bring some overalls for you on the road. Uh, She's gonna be like, yeah, I think you left your wardrobe. <laughs> Not that. What the fuck, Ty? It's my allergies. It's my sneeze. To hear it was like, heavy D at the uh, Million Talent Show. <laughs> I sneeze. I'm outside in the pollen. Hey, Ty, would you do that if it was like this is a Minion show? Here, and, <laughs> we gotta do our sets as minions. <laughs> Would you do a, a hot fifteen? Oh my god! Bro. You know what? Because I support my friend, then yes, I will. Thanks, Ty. Oh, I appreciate it. Let's, let's, uh, <laughs> let's just put it to a vote then. Let's, <laughs> let's, hey, let, let's put it to a vote. Minion or onion? <laughs> <laughs> no, here's the vote. You think Tahir is going to wear these glasses again on Squadcast? <laughs> you goddamn right I am. Oh, goddamn man. right I am. You get a shit about oh. none of that. I like these glasses. Fuck y'all, man. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> um, barbecue versus pizza. What are we going with? Pizza. 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 Ah. <laughs> All right. Pizza. <laughs> In a minute. Pizza. Woo. <laughs> pizza. 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 pizza at the same time. <laughs> pizza. <laughs> Lulu, you having a good time? <laughs> hey, it's time a nigga ask you if you having a good time. Y'all having fun over there laughing at that? Ooh, That's ooh, the equivalent of everybody be like, they be like, hey, look at your boy. Look at your boy. Yeah. Oh, man. Man. None of it is in good spirit. We're going to move on to this last topic <laughs> right after this. Last topic of the day, we have, which would you rather do? Wear lingerie to a friend's gathering versus go new to a business meeting. Would, is lingerie for both men and women? Yeah, you ain't got no lingerie, yeah. my boy. Would that consider box like boxing? Hold on, hold on, Pat, hold on, Pat, hold on, Pat, because you don't even deserve to be in that kind. To hear what the fuck wrong with you, man? What are you talking about? This nigga ain't got no lingerie, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. What you on, fam? You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> what do you on, man? What you ain't got no little, the G the G like an like elephant trunk. Nigga, and it's like the elephant you trunk have... and you got your ass out. And it's yeah. a thong. Nigga, you better not put on a goddamn savage fanty. 
fat chick. <laughs> oh, they we came back in overalls. <laughs> <laughs> they got pants for men. They got Savage Fenty robes uh, and, and pajama sets. On, oh my God, bro. What are we doing, man? <laughs> I'm definitely would wear the lingerie at a friend's uh, event because uh, I might find something there, you know. You know. Hey, what if he brought back that little string you tie around ham? <laughs> that's the hey, hair yeah, yeah, yeah. that little yeah. netting yeah <laughs> and it say freak <laughs> freak by the pound <laughs> freak by the pound <laughs> a little honey baked netting oh uh, the little man, man. Hey, no, he put the honey bag and then it say deli belly <laughs> <laughs> well, some of this deli belly <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I know you want to slice this deli belly. <laughs> That's is that the name of the clothing line, deli belly? <laughs> hey, bro. Yes, man. Uh, yes. Look, this this is look some some shorts right here, right? Those are basketball shorts, bro. They're you bought the box. They go. They go, they they go, go with the roll. They go. Is that with the Savage bowl. Fenty? Nah, this is uh this black uh designer oh, called. Oh, that's smooth. That looks oh, great. Yeah. Right, but if you want to step it up, you want to step it up. You know, you get the you get the savage roll. This one comes with like the, you know, what I'm saying the see through. Oh, that's joints. cute. You know, I, that, that's you all considered lingerie. Man, put that goddamn CeeLo green looking ass shit down. <laughs> you, got the, you got the red silk. Some people like freaking in the night. Some people like freaking at night. Right. <laughs> the the lime green savage joints. Ooh. Okay. And then if you want to take it to the next level. That's what I'm talking about. Hell no. Nah. That's what I'm talking about. Your ass out. That looks like a sports bra. Listen. Ooh, little that's, Jackie that's, Strap. That's Come here. Ooh. You know Come here. Let's play a game real quick. Let me tap you on your ass. Good game. You know what I'm I got, I got, I got, I got why like have, Why do you, to hear, why, why do you have sleek sumo wear? <laughs> he put that on to be like Mortal Kombat. <laughs> it makes it, it's, it's, it's aerodynamic when I'm eating. I can run oh, fast to the kitchen. Man, <laughs> this nigga here, like I, I like my whole ass in, in some sweatpants. You know what I'm saying? So I like to, you know, what I'm saying, have my ass out. Hey, listen, nigga, I'm, I'm, I'm no just, a, I'm an equal opportunity freak with my wife. I like the way my wife looks in lingerie. She likes oh, the way man. I look in lingerie. Man. You know what I'm saying? If you're not comfortable with your sexuality to please your wife like that, CP, then just say that, brother. I'm throwing fair If you intimidated, just fair say that. Like, I swear to God, nobody told him to buy that, y'all. Hey, that shit's sexy. <laughs> my, wife, my, wife, my wife bought most of that for me. What are you talking hey, about? The sexy answer thing, I love when they come out. He got some, like, uh, in black. He got the black robe with some black boxer briefs. and ooh, I got the black doable. one, too. Got the, the black answer, one, too. The answer to this question 100% falls on what's considered lingerie between those harnesses that we just saw and those <laughs> and the robes cuz i'm down with the robes and the robes all, all of it all of it falls on the lingerie all of it yeah, i wear that lingerie. anyway I'll tell you something i'm going butt ass naked to the meeting and i'm getting this shit over with who likes this and hey, let's go from there <laughs> who the fuck is fucking with this let's go <sighs> You gonna end up at Brazzers, <laughs> hey man? Like I said, like I said, if 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 I gotta put some satin on my ass or walk out, what's wrong with I'm, satin? Why you don't like satin? Hey, what's satin do to you? Soft material is a like fantastic it's material. It's soft. It feels they good. Inching us, they inching us down that road. What's wrong with satin? Hey, what's wrong with, with the toxic masculinity? Like, like, no, I ain't oh. never heard satin was only for women, nigga. What the <laughs> Detroit, fuck? Detroit has you ruined this. You don't like satin? He doesn't appreciate the finer things in life. Detroit has ruined this man. I got a rap for the real niggas on here. Detroit, no, I got No, that ain't real. That's stupid. No, that's that's, stupid. That's, that's real. That's real. You going to go to Maldives and they going to give you some satin sheets. You going to be like, ah, who gave me this gay shit? Who going to give me this? this I don't nigga. want this. What's wrong with satin? This nigga is light skinned with a cranberry see-through robe. Talk about <laughs> The robe ain't see-through, just the bottoms off. The robe ain't see-through. Fuck out of here. I got my vote, nigga. This nigga has a see-through satin. Okay, that's a that's 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 Ooh, see that's how solid cute. that is, Pat. That's solid. But here's the short. His stops at his ass cheeks. No, Everything don't. else is hanging out. Fuck you. This is a full length. Yeah, bro. Ain't nothing wrong with that. What man. you wearing on, on the bottoms though, Pat? Nothing. Winnie the Pooh. I come in okay, like, then. like a like a dick out samurai. <laughs> I had a dude do that to me too. He had a robe on with nothing on the bottom. I was like, oh shit. Okay. 
come through with the teacups filled with tequila. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, let do it. That. That's a cool road, man. You know, eat sushi you? off a of booty. And so you want you you, you want to see through. Listen, dog, I I I, I got like man. eight robes. I ain't even gonna lie. I got like eight robes. I got a whole bunch of sets and stuff like as that. As you should, as you should. This is satin, though. I think. No, maybe I don't know. Yeah, that's just sexy. That look, that, that look like a very big do rag, and I like that. That's, that's <laughs> you are a nigga, bro. <laughs> we didn't get him on our side until I put oh, on and then here come, and then look, 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 look. Here come the uh, choir solo master right here. <laughs> I see because cool. I'm fat. I see because I'm free. But I don't eat food that's fat free. Cause that shit just ain't me. Say it again. <laughs> I sing because I'm fat. I sing because I'm free. Um, but I don't eat food. Listen, that's I don't expect free. CP. I don't Cause, expect you to like roll. That shit just ain't me. You know, a lot. Sometimes they don't have pockets. You ain't got no burgers. Hallelujah. On. I get it. Nuggets make you sing. If there was a, if there was like a, uh, uh, look uh, with uh, smoothies. Uh, no, that's not me. An NBA robe or something like that that was satin, would you wear it? Unless it's ice cream. Say it again now, say it loud. <laughs> Burgers, hallelujah. A oh, third verse. Nuggets. <laughs> yeah, a third verse. <laughs> it's a good song. Good song. It's gospel. It's, tell it's you gospel. about your only child. You don't know when to stop. I can tell. <laughs> you don't know when to stop. <laughs> His parents just let them go on. They just let them tune them out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that baby got bad. That baby got bad. Oh, I'm, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. You guys, can, you guys can pick on me. I know. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> uh, the victim switch. He just did a three verse gospel song calling me a fat ass, but now he wants to be the victim. Well, I thought it was clever switch. because you're fat and you're free, but you don't eat fat free stuff because that's just not you. <laughs> we heard it the first time. <laughs> you're, you're, fat not phobic. Like, you're, you're not fat, supposed to like You're fat phobic. You don't like nice stuff. You, you're making Detroit just seem like stereotypical for, for the men there. That's what you're the representation of that, CP. I just want you to know I love that. Satin. Well, you make it St. Louis look like niggas be wearing their ass out in their drawers. <laughs> and I guess we're even. <laughs> I see a mountain climbing harnesses you put on and be like, let's, <laughs> let's, let's climb the pleasures bill or whatever the fuck you say. Pound town, baby. You get to the top of that mountain, it's pound town. Pound town. <laughs> Can I sing look. my song again? Go ahead, man. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm Wait, good. let's all look like Ty Davis, though. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead with your little song. <laughs> Go ahead with your little song. Uh, y'all got it. I got more say leopard sing, print baby. Coming. Sing, I baby. You can in my business. Damn. Nah, we, know, we know. We know, Ty. We know. Thinking Ty. about the next leopard dress, the next leopard <laughs> pillowcase. <laughs> I ain't going to hold what you. What the fuck else these, comes in leopard? Look, hmm. <laughs> years, I found these leopard pants that I bought like a few years ago because I was packing for this weekend. I was like, oh, shit, I ain't worn these since January 22. I'm going to break these bitches out for that Georgia show. I hey. think I might wear them pants now. Tag me in hey. any photos. George is going to be so motherfucking fun. <laughs> I'm a taggy fat. I'm wearing the pants. George is going to be so motherfucking fun. Uh, Ty, George What's going to be fun? Be so I can't. Georgia. We're going okay. to uh, Estelle, Georgia. Hell like right outside Atlanta. Estelle? To do some, yeah. Estelle. Are y'all going to Atlanta? Atlanta? Yeah, we're going to Atlanta. I'm going to do Atlanta July 3rd. I'm 3rd. pulling up. Pull up, bro. I'm pulling up. Good ass time. See, like you Atlanta, free man. pull up, man. Pull up on a real nigga. I like Atlanta, man. Atlanta's cool, man. Atlanta's it's gonna be a good cool. time, man. We out here. So, Another CP, Atlanta. we really, we really can't get you in a robe, bro. I have robes, bro. I have a robe. I have a, I have a nice Versace robe upstairs. What Ooh. are they? Like the towel material? The towel yeah, material. It's the heavy one. Those are fire. Terry cloth. Yeah. You can just get right Terry out cloth. the shower with that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it has like, but it has like these like satin, like, um, like, 
Only on the collar and on the on the middle. It looks like Pat's roll with that shit. You know what I'm saying? That's you it. limited limit the satin. Like I, I don't limit the satin, bro. It's just like I don't. As a man, though, I don't. I, I just don't want nothing directly on my ass like that, like smooth like that. You know, I just want like some draws on. Oh, or you want some draws? I, so you I, wear I, like I, Euro pad draw. draws, nigga? What are you wearing? Like, you why do you have no silk draws? Drawer? You don't have one pair of satin silk. I ain't got no silk draws because I don't. I don't like. I, that's not how I wear my. But you can wear my, regular draws. He doesn't with the like satin the robe. texture. It's that's the texture for him. You feel like it's just it, that's like panty esque. I don't know why niggas want that. Like I don't know, but that's just have you wore though. panties before? Nah, but it just looked then like. How you know what panties feel like? Cause I didn't ram my motherfucking fingers over some goddamn <laughs> panties. <laughs> times, my nigga. I know what no. I know what panties in the ass feel like. What the fuck are you talking about? No, what are you talking about? What do you mean? Same, nigga. Who? It ain't the uh, same. Red, my motherfucking That's like you said, I don't know what dicks feel like because I done felt dicks in my hand all the time. You know I don't how know they how sit dicks in the feel drawers, in real life though. all the time. Lulu, hold on, hold on, Lulu. So would you want would you want to be in some loose boxers for your for your for your drawers for the day? It depends. What am I doing? Sometimes I do want some loose ass panties. She be hooping. <laughs> right. Okay. Well, Ty, Ty, do you want do you want some loose ass boxer draw? <laughs> well, it depends. Okay. Sometimes you gotta let that thing air out. All right, so, oh, yeah. Lulu, it on what you doing. You know what I'm saying? I like regular ass draws. Okay, look. Hold on. You know what? On what I'm doing. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ethica draws. They have like a different. They almost feel like yeah. What are um, the bombas? They're like bombas. Like they got spandex. the same material as bombas. Yeah. Because they're, yeah. they're like workout underwear. Yeah. yeah. So some shit fire. like that. Though, but those kind of get on my nerves too because they're not like what? breathable. They're not like breathable for real. They kind of like, oh, you know those are saying? fire. You like, you still wear boxers or you wear boxer briefs? Boxer briefs, regular boxer briefs, like mm -hmm. cotton, regular boxer briefs. You know what so I'm saying? They have the same hug. Yeah. They have the same hug as boxer they briefs. They do, though. but the material feels like a Halloween costume. It feels like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just it feels do. like, <laughs> you know that's what a I'm hilarious saying? example, but it, that's nice. Yeah, it's cool. For my draws every day, some fucking, Gymnastics, shit, I'm straight. I, I just need to breathe. You know, I don't do that right. every day. I, I only put that Lou's on. Lulu's very upset with me. I'm sorry, dog. I don't well, like I'm only, what, what kind I of drawers you I be wearing every day? I'm concerned uh, now. It's pound town. I don't walk around with a jock strap on. I only put the jock strap on. Are you wearing baggy boxer briefs? No, I wear tight boxer briefs, but they're the material, Lulu. It's the material. Okay, so you only like cotton. That's it, just cotton. For the most part, that's like that's okay. like my favorite thing. You know what I'm saying? This is. Okay. I'm sorry to disappoint everybody. Hey, that's no, we learned it. It's, it's no. your preference. Yeah, we don't got his I feel like my drawers aren't exotic enough. Now I got to go to no, fucking no, Marshalls to life, go man. to the drawers live department. Your life, live your boring regular. drawers life. You know, if you want to keep your drawers boring as fuck, that's you. Stay in your lane. Be happy oh, you. with your boring basic drawers. <laughs> You have on a guy on tank top, Lulu. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> Sonic what Boom. Does that mean? My drawers are still popping. What the fuck does that mean? I don't know. I was just trying to roast you to divert. You're so aggressive. Uh -uh, don't be trying to roast me. I'm a roast professional mean? now. What the fuck does that mean? Nigga, I was just talking about the tank top. I don't know what you want me to say, Lulu. I've, I've roasted everybody on here today. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Pat, I didn't know that other was a baby crunk shirt. That's hard. But other than that, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, Lulu. Lulu be like, hey, what the fuck? <laughs> I think I roast people. God damn. But that's yeah, been better from you. That was, do it again. Yeah, hold on. different. Lulu, Lulu, I got to call you because you do be mad aggressive. Hold up. I saw a compilation. You know Jazz Jones make the compilation. Gotcha. And so I saw a compilation where you fucking snapped on somebody. I don't want to say their name, but you snapped on that cop. You was like, shut the fuck up. You always talking. I was like, nigga, I'm a... Oh, yeah, I'm telling you about who. I'm sending that shit to me too. I want to watch it right after this. <laughs> who is that? Send me that compilation. Yo, Lulu, she does. Lulu she does compilations for all of us. Oh, I want to see that. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah, she, 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 uh, Jazz Jones on YouTube and TikTok. She's you know so funny. So I only amazing. heard like, that shit. Take... I only started hearing that shit when I moved to LA. In New York, I ain't never heard none of this shit. Everybody's like that in New you, York. Because everyone's like that. That's what Everybody I'm saying. Everybody be like, man, you be mad aggressive. And I'm like, I me and my niggas talk like this all the damn time. I'm like, I don't know <laughs> no, what. No, Lulu. What y'all be talking told about? that person, shut the, you was like, shut the fuck up. You always talking. Oh, that you was Keetra. I was there when Keetra was on? Yeah, Keetra was running her goddamn mouth. I was like, hey, that's a totally normal sentence in New York, though. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Bitch ass nigga. They be like, okay, my bad. Yeah. 
Yeah, keep your oh, respect, mouth. respect, queen, respect, respect. You got me right there, queen. Respect. Hey, I saw a video where a dude walked in the shop. He walked in the bodega and he went up to his homie, I guess, who did the cashier. He was like, hey, I smacked the fuck out of you, bro. I want a sandwich. And that was just like, he was just like, all right, for sure, man. And I was just like, damn, this culture different. Yeah, that's how <laughs> it be. He, 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 smacked he the shit opened out with you a threat. Sandwich. He said, I smacked yeah, the morning. fuck out of you, bro. You heard? Yeah. Uh, let's put it to a vote. What are we going? We going wear lingerie to a friend's gathering versus go to a, go nude to a business meeting. Lingerie well, that's, that's me, illegal. please. Lingerie. We forget about the we forgot about the legal part of that. You as nah, a, man, wizard. The wizard is happy there. You there? You good? But is it like is it regular office temperature? Because I'm not at my full form. <laughs> Which business meeting is this? Is this like Hulu? Like Netflix? If it's a business meeting, it's probably something you don't want to fuck up. Which means you gonna fuck it up by being naked. Well, I mean, y'all, y'all are business, different, bro. We, I'm an actor. I'm going to a business meeting. They probably gonna want to see my dick anyway because they wanted me to be in something. So it's like, fuck it, let's get this over with. Kind of meetings. You the been requirements doing? now? No, I'm saying like, let's say like you on like an HBO show <laughs> and they're like, oh, you're going to be new on the show. <laughs> like, CP just told us that he had to reveal his dick in every meeting. He's been That's he not said, what I'm saying. I mean, they're going to pull my dick out anyway. So. No, what wait, I'm wait, saying wait. is like, you watch like Euphoria, you watch all these shows, like they're showing niggas dicks now. It used to be like women, they had to see your body. Nah, they probably want to see niggas dicks for real to be like, okay. That's crazy. Well, you can't get a stunt I'm, dick? Like you get, get probably, like, you probably could get a stunt dick if you need one. They be like, you know crazy. what? We're gonna line you up with a stunt dick. We, we don't think that's the right dick for the paint my the dick with CGI dick. green. That'd be hard. And then well, you just don't want to show your dick. You know, you're like, you're not wrong with yours. Be like, you know, I want to keep that to me, to myself. You know, I don't want to be Jesse Williams out here. That's but real. thank God for Jesse Williams. I heard he was mad at that. He was upset. He should be. I think that was just for PR, though. I'm sure he was like. <laughs> I mean, he was like, wow, hilarious. He was hard? What kind of play was that? What the he fuck wasn't was even on? hard, and it was oh. just fantastic. Okay, my bad. I thought he was on, on stage, center stage, just with a hard dick. Like, I was like, yo, that was, it's a whole different picture. Than but I he did smack his shit, That nigga's though. an actor. You understand? Know that nigga's, that nigga can get into it. Like, yeah, he yeah. did. <laughs> he did smack his shit to show people, like, it was real, you know? Yeah. What? What? Yeah. I don't it was, know. yeah. Yeah, he like someone did, smacked like, it smack. on stage. Yes, you want there was video? another man in the scene. <clears throat> it's about and Jesse. It was Jesse Williams. Was like it's like about a gay baseball player or something like that. And so it was him and another naked man in the scene. And Jesse, Jesse was swinging Thor's hammer, baby. I'm telling you, it was so amazing that hey. you. Ty, you trying to go to the show? You trying to take a road trip? Swinging the Look, let's, go, let's go get some tickets, girl. Hey, you get the show out. No one explained the, the dick smack. Oh, he was just standing it, there. He was because it's like a shower scene. Yeah. And they're like they're in the shower. And he just like went like that to his, to his joint. And they were just like, why? Why did he do yeah. that? Listen. I don't know. And I don't care. He's trying to go viral, like, Pat, and it worked. The nigga was like, watch it this. Worked. It's Broadway. I mean, like, he didn't know nobody was recorded. He didn't know because they wasn't supposed to be recording. You know, right, it's to Broadway. Play. They wasn't supposed to have their phone. And the girl took it yeah. out and was like, yeah, "But you know, it was it, it was that girl fourth time going through the show. So right. Exactly what she was like. Yeah, and he, yeah, yeah. And he, he it, it looked like him and the dude kiss. Like a lot of people didn't pay attention to that whole clip. Yeah, I don't care about a lot of people didn't pay. I was like, because after yeah, because after the seven hundred. The 68 time that I saw it, I was like, did he just kiss that nigga? I don't even care. Put that meat back on there, man. Listen. Yeah. I ain't see none of that. I ain't see none of that. So I, I ain't look from the, the head up. I was looking from Listen. chest down. I ain't look none of that. He wasn't even all the way. See here, I showed it to my mama. She tried to put her, my whole phone in her mouth. She was like, girl, what you doing? What you doing? <laughs> Relax. She was like, you trying to go? I was like, yes, mama. We Let's go. Let's put, put it to, to a show. vote. We try to go. That was not the scene that I thought happened. Lingerie from Ty, lingerie from me. Is this how, is this how you sell more tickets? Is this is this is this what niggas gotta do to sell out on the road? Hey, just have somebody smack yeah. your dick on stage, man. No, he smacked his own dick. He smacked, he smacked his, his own. Dick. Oh wait, you want me to send it to you? You want me to send it to you, Pat? Child look like a baby arm. Oh my god, I still got it in my phone. Smacking his own dick is hilarious. I'm gonna send it to Pat. All right. Well, looks like the lingerie has it. <laughs> Wait, you didn't tell us our votes. You didn't tell us the vote. Oh, I, I voted for I lingerie. Did. I said lingerie versus going to the meeting. Wait, ask for my vote. Pat, what's your vote? Pizza. 
<laughs> thank you guys so, so much for watching another episode of Squadcast Versus. So thank you guys, guest Todd Davis, Lulu Gonzalez. Shout out to the original squad, man. Appreciate y'all as always. We'll see you next week on another episode of Squadcast Versus. Peace. <laughs>